46 year female with a history of malaria and uh, what you are seeing on your screen is the uh, transfer section of the uterus with uh, endometrial canal. This is the endometrial canal and uh, it measures 26 mm and normal is up to 40. Now why it is 26 is because she is uh, on drugs for the last uh, couple of months because uh, of uh, then these hormones that she has been taking for menorrhagia. This is endometrial hyperplasia. So the endometrial canal in fact is showing hyperplasia. And because of the same reason, no significant blood supply is seen. And because of the same reasons, you are, this is the uh, left ovary, this one. You are seeing a follicle measuring approximately 16 mm. And this is a, a dominant follicle uh, uh, and can also be because of the hormonal intake, exogenous uh, hormonal intake. Now, if we concentrate, why she is having menorrhagia can be addressed by this view in which you are seeing an approximately measuring Fourteen point four into twenty point three millimeter, well demarcated. This one, hypochoic solid focal mass lesion because there is no significant posterior wall enhancement that is giving pressure effect on the endometrial canal. This is the endometrial canal, and this is the cause of menorrhagia. This is submucosal and it is giving pressure effect on the uh, endometrial canal and, as, and is the cause of uh, menorrhagia in this particular patient. Now, you, see, you can see an indent into the, in the uh, endometrial canal. Uh, this, you know, this is the endometrial canal and it is being elevated here by this fibroid in the submucosal location. And uh, fibroids usually don't take blood, but this one is, you can see this one is being fed. There is blood flow within it. So there is blood within it, uh, flow within it. Now, I am going to give a sweep to the probe of more than 90 degrees and let's see if it changes its shape. Rather, I have given 180 degree sweep and you can see that it persists. It does not change its shape and it remains as such. In all, this is the uh, fibroid in magnified view, this one. Going back, see the indent, and this is the hyperplasia, endometrial hyperplasia, endometrial the fibroid, uh, myometrial fibroid, submucosal, giving pressure effect, and uh, this is the normal view. Here you see, this is the left ovary, right ovary, sorry, this is the right ovary, again follicular activity is seen, and uh, this is uh, our case of the day, thank you very much.